so far what I think about this game is that it's definitely a good game and this comes from expert game a doubt it do has is uh, cringe moments like how in the last chapter that uh, that I forgot his name tries to shoot uh, no got in front of that other person and try to block the gunshot instead of just aiming his own gun and fucking <coughs> and shoot the the thing shoot the fucker yeah, that is very cringe <coughs> It is also definitely a game that RPG gamers would like this. It has many RPG elements in it. Of course if <coughs> wanna play a perfect RPG you look to FF7 R first. I'm trying to get to the next part of the story, not the fan event. Um, an odd used whoop right head and pick that up. See, <coughs> this is another thing here with the question mark, and then another here. Basically, there's some new stuff after you complete a certain amount of chapters, apparently. But not that much new stuff. There's also some. So, two more here. This, this game is certainly not lacking in terms of things to do.
Oh, Yagami-san. Sorry, son. Yes? I have another favor I want to ask you. Oh? Think you can handle it? Oh, I think you forgot to buy food. You have to get some food first. Tell me what it is. Oh, sure. you're now also controlling her di di dialogue as well. Yes. All right then, we need you to set a honey trap for Keto. A what? It's when you seduce a man to get information. And you're sure you want me? How could you <laughs> ask her to do that? You can't be serious. Look, we need to get to Keto somehow. This is the best shot we have of luring him into Kamurocho. Don't be ridiculous. Asking her to be a hostess is one thing, but you can't make her sleep with that creep. Hold on there, Hoshinokun. <laughs> Isn't that what a honey trap is? I never said that. You don't have to listen to them, sorry san I mean, just talking about this is practically entrapment. Not to be rude, but I asked sorry san not you. Why do you care so much anyway? Because I care about her. Oh? You... what? Uh, no, I... I... I mean, I, I have a, a lot of respect for her as a co-worker. Well, that's enough of that. Yagami, you sure there'll be no risk to Sauriko? Absolutely. I have a plan. Which is what, exactly? I'll tell you once we get there. First, I need to know if you're in. It's what the investigation calls for. Sorry, son. I want to avenge Shitani Sensei's death, too. <laughs> Thank you. All right. And we don't have time to lose. We? Since when was it <laughs> we? This is really what Sorry, son wants. I'll do everything in my power to help her. Uh huh. Oh, we'll need another makeover. Uh, also, you I have to uh, help with keep Mind if we use that, the same uh, salon? Scientist sure. to I was thinking she'd be a journalist this stuff. Time. Not a hostess. A journalist? Really? Think about it. Your mark is inside the ADDC, right? You'll be able to get him alone much more naturally if you go in asking for an interview. Uh huh. And you'll need to dress the part. I'm talking high skirts and low cuts. That'll bring out the worst in any old lech. <laughs> now we're talking. I'll take that over a hostess any day. Also, uh, what? <laughs> hey, I have some things I need to take care of. Can also, some Wayako help Sorry, son. We'll meet there. Okay. See you soon. This old to this old person definitely did some Wayako. Sorry, son. Let's get you that makeover. Right. Here we are, sorry, san Hair salon cherry. I'm honestly a little nervous. Didn't I already do this when I was a hostess? Sure, but everything's different this time. Sorry, san the journalist. An intellectual beauty. Classy, worldly. Oh, what guy wouldn't fall for that? Don't give me that look. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to stare. Anyway, mm, I'm sure you'll be stunning no matter guitar. how much makeup you wear. And if I disappoint you? Well, that's just not possible. I hope you're right. Let's turn to the dam here. It's fucking, dis fucking disgusting. I mean, this haircut would be good on someone else. 
phase C. That here. Yeah. This is not bad. This is also not bad. So. This is what I used last time. It has using something different this time. So. This picking thing looks like it's from the Guanch. <laughs> Just picking this some quick piece of shit. I mean. I don't curse in this with the channel. <coughs> but this is not bad, is This is still looks better, but we try different style this time. What did I use last? What did she use last time? I'm not fucking sure. Yeah, this one was like. So this time was.
Nice batu kos. I can't even tell what kind of card this is. What the heck kind of card is this? Looks kind of blue, but also like it's, it's pink. This is definitely a light green. It is either this one, this one, or this, one, this one. This is ridiculous. Can you imagine that freaking barber shop? Whoever is in the barber shop literally are waiting for all day for him to be freaking decision. Literally. They has to be this one. This also looks good. <clears throat> I'm thinking of like <clears throat> a coating. Yes, the color that the coating is just like, it just fits more with this. With these two, it looks good, but it doesn't like bend in with the golden. This one just seems like it blends in. Okay, I'm going to choose this one. What else is there? How the heck do you change tricks? 
Oh, here. Card pin. You can also change the eye color. Can you imagine I the feet woman who like to go to this saloon like that and you can turn a little like a tit fire into a uh, fire like that. Just ridiculous. This is the certain look that all. How the head is this look that all? <laughs> what the that is faking with that is the cow turn. It's near this one or this one. That's all. Goddess Salry san. Just incredible. That off limits allure, that mature aura. Are you going to stop soon? Sorry. I just get a little excited. Well, I'm ready to go. I can take it from here. So independent, too. Oh, sorry. I'll stop now. Well? Salry san. Um. Uh, hmm? Don't push yourself, okay? If things get dangerous, just run. Just one, you mean the uh, you can just take my uh, uh thing uh, <coughs> uh, uh 
a phone and and call the <laughs> authority or something. Yagami-san said I'll be safe though. Well, yeah, your life might not be in danger, but what if Kido tries to, you know, cop a feel or something? If that's what needs to happen, that's what will happen. <laughs> what? But I should be going. No, and literally, Sorry, he's going to one up my archer, and that that will just be. Yeah. Thank you for complimenting my makeup. It felt nice. What? His her personality kind of changes when you uh, with a different different style apparently. A different style here. Which is good to know. Maybe it is Copen or some other style. Hold on, sorry son. Take this with you. It's a hidden camera. A what? See, this is the lens. Any footage it takes gets sent to my phone in real time. Here, wear this earpiece too. I'll give you some conversation pointers while you're in there. Oh? Yeah, this time you'll need to be seductive with the words you say, not just your looks. So... You're going to give me <coughs> tips, Yagami-san? I'd appreciate that. Wait, really? Of course. Knowing how to woo man isn't exactly my specialty. Also, what happens after I seduce him? Once Kido starts coming on to you, we'll catch it all on the camera. Meaning there will be evidence of his sexual harassment. Yeah, your job will be done at that point. All we'll need to do after that is use the footage to lure him to Kamurocho. Blackmailing, hmm? Think you can handle it? Don't worry. The more perverted things Keto does, the more he'll suffer later. Yeah, I guess. I'd rather keep his hands off of me as much as possible, though. That'll be on you and your direction, Yagami-san. Right. Anyway, you should head in. Can you hear me, Sari-san? First, you're going to want to go to the reception desk. Ask the lady there if you can interview Kido. Just make something up about wanting more details on 89. Sounds good. Welcome, ma'am. Do you have an appointment? No. I was wondering if Director Kido would be available for an interview. And you are? A freelance journalist by the name of Shirosaki. I wanted to speak with him about 89. I'm terribly sorry, ma'am. I can't let you in without an appointment. Oh, I see. In that case, um... Don't be afraid to press the issue, sorry, son. I, um... Director Kido is a very busy man. I'm sure you understand. It won't take long, I assure you. And I can wait if need be. Even so... Please, can I at least see Kido-san and ask him myself? I'm sorry, ma'am. We decline all requests without a prior appointment. Oh, I think I could make an exception for such a pretty girl. <laughs> huh? <coughs> I'm Kido, the director of this center. I hear you want to interview me. <laughs> ah, yes. My name is Shirosaki. Shirosaki-san, hmm? Come, I'll show you to my office. A beautiful woman like yourself deserves VIP treatment. Are you sure, sir? Thank you very much. Ugh, Kido-san. No, he's not even trying to hide it. Not that I'm complaining. <laughs> Please, come in. Wow, this is your office? Breathtaking. I love how spacious it is. Oh, <laughs> no need to flatter me, though I do get quite a few compliments. Please, take a seat. Sorry, son. Put the camera on the table. You really must excuse me. I should have made an appointment instead of just showing up on your doorstep. Move it a little to the right, about 15 degrees. 
perfect. Would you care for a drink, Shirosaki-san? Maybe a glass of brandy? There's one that I found camera recently. seems it's truly top that... shelf. What? The... What? <laughs> this one is funny. Hey, definitely not this one. Okay. This one's the cover answer. Well, sure, I'll have some. It's a special occasion after all. Here you are. I think I'm going to enjoy this interview. Good job, sorry, son. Keep it up. To a wonderful interview. Yes, to the interview. Mmm. It's incredible. Really warms you up deep in your core, right? Yes. Undo another button, sorry, son. Huh? Is something the matter? Oh, <coughs> uh, no, it's just getting a little toasty in here. Well, uh, <clears throat> yes, I am feeling warmer. Good going. He's taking the bait. Now then, <clears throat> what is this interview about? Discuss 89. You're more interesting than some stuffy old drug. I see. This is better than I was expecting. So, will you tell me, big boy? Well, there's a lot I could say. I'm just not sure I should say it here. Huh? But it's just the two of us. You can do whatever you want. <laughs> You're even more aggressive than I expected. <laughs> Not yet. Work comes first. <laughs> yes, I uh, suppose the real fun can wait until later. <laughs> well played, sorry, son. Now then. Uh, where were we? You should get this over with as quick as possible. Make your move, sorry, son. Hmm. In that case... Oh, this one, this one. so steamy in here don't you think yes yes <laughs> I'm burning up I totally agree with you huh Wait, sorry son are you really gonna keep going ah uh, that's better oh. sorry son it uh, kind of seems like you're enjoying this uh, he's the worst How's this? Just wonderful. I think that's enough photos for now. All right, sorry, son. You're good. Wrap it up. How did they turn out? Oh, do you want to? <gasps> You're right in the frame. This is a perfect backup. Stay strong, sorry, son. Maybe if he's a, a chat, you would not say that he's gross. That's because he's an uh, old cell and, and uh, not chat, <laughs> you would say that. Gross. Pretty sure that if I am the dash, you would. Uh, the very. Th 
if you are very differently. Oh, you've made me a very happy man today. When we have some real fun now that the interview's out of the way, hmm? my little minx. Well, um. How about dinner tonight? That's perfect. Draw Wait, just out. dinner. Okay, let's do it in Camarocho. Camarocho? Um, how about somewhere else? I'd rather stay close by. Oh, I think I can convince you. Hmm. How so? You'll see. Sorry, son, start getting weirdly into that whole thing at some point. Yeah, she was, uh, it's kind of scaring me towards the end. Anyway, you think Kido's actually gonna show? He'd be a fool not to. I just sent him the footage under Sorry, son's name. Said we'd put it online if he didn't show. <laughs> Guess he doesn't have a choice then. Where'd you tell him to go? The batting center. Sugira and Higashi went ahead to keep an eye on the place. What's gotten into you, man? I don't know if I've ever seen you this organized. I can't afford to take my time with this. Okubo Kun's execution date is coming up fast. Yes, oh. good point. Come on, we should go. Let's roll. They're going to kill uh, with this Count Jesus. Oh, get out of the way. 